Do you realize it has been eight days since I've had a date? Do you realize it's been eight days since I had... Ma, a... please. <laughs> Whatever it is, keep it to yourself. That's my problem. <laughs> oh, look. Here's one of us on a, on a bicycle built for two. I'll never forget <laughs> that spring day in 1940. I was thinking... Ma, you're making this up. <laughs> You idiot, there's no way I'm ever gonna pass for a man. Dorothy, trade with me? Go to hell, Myron. It's probably no good to begin with. After all, you cooked it. That does it! Ma got something caught in her throat. <laughs> would you like something to drink? A tea would be lovely if it's no trouble. No, not at all. I already had some boiling water on account of this cyst on my Ma! Now, there's no one home during the day to take care of it. I'm home during the day. No one lucid is home during the day. <laughs> Why, you think I can't do it? You think I'm irresponsible? Yes, Ma. You think I'm forgetful? Yes, Ma. You think I'm irresponsible? You already said that. <laughs> I'll go through the personal to find myself a man. Remember what that is, Dorothy? It's an animal. Kind of like a woman, except that it's got a... Ma! <laughs> They can sleep in Ma's room, and she'll sleep with me. Oh, Ma doesn't get a say. It doesn't matter what Ma thinks. Ma's a piece of furniture who has no feelings or opinions. Oh, nonsense, my little hat rack. Hi, pussycat. Say goodbye, old woman. Have a good time? Do I sound like I had a good time? How the hell should I know? You're always like this. Maybe if I just whispered it. I can't believe you went along with this. So I got in bed with Dorothy. It was a joke. Don't even think it, Ma. <laughs> well, now that I'm up, I might as well do some shopping. Get back here, you deceitful little Sicilian gecko. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> To widow, to wait. Blanche tells me she worked very closely with the caterer. Did she tell you they were naked most of the time? You'll have to excuse my mother. She was a witness to the Hindenburg disaster. Uh, it doesn't matter what your parents want. Rose, you're never going to make them happy. They're just going to nag you and nag you until you want to grab their throats and choke them. But you don't because you're in a hospital with resuscitating equipment. That money's for my old age. Old age? You don't leave fingerprints anymore. I'm in my twilight years. You're in the twilight zone. Blanche, if you don't mind, I'm having a heart-to-heart -heart with my mother. Now listen up, you withered old Sicilian monkey. What kind of pain and embarrassment has this lifestyle caused your mother? I really don't know, but I'll ask her tomorrow when I visit her at the home. I hope we get to see more of you. Don't even bother.